So guys, we're back. And uh, here's the box. Yes, let's go, baby! Look at that steel! Fourth place, little white one. This guy's 16 pounds steelhead. We got him! We got him! Oh, man! Oh! Gorgeous brown. Holy smoke, we got him. We got him. Oh, my gosh! Oh. Look at the cash. Big like little boat. We got a king on the dip What do you think? Yeah! I can tell. I've seen some, some of the bands they did. Guys, this is uh, Jay. He's a longtime subscriber to the channel. He's reached out to me and uh, he made it out today. Great dude. Great, great dude. I'm glad I actually got to meet him. So he's going to be fishing alongside with us out here. Looking forward to it. I'm liking that kicker. What's that? Three and a half hours. Well, you made it here a good time. I love that kicker. Ready? Yeah, yeah, I'm, we're pretty pumped up. The fishing's been good. It's been really good here. So I think we're gonna go out to uh, the break wall, Kaimit okay, Harbor break wall, and set up. They probably expect that. Yeah, what a beautiful morning. Jay's coming in with his buddy. Max and the boys are getting set up. I got a friend with me today, uh, Brian. It's gonna be four of us. Yo, hey, Max, Max. Nice, to meet you. nice to meet you, man. Nice to meet you. My pleasure. Logan. What's your name? Logan. Logan, Joe. Hello, nice Jesus. to meet you. I'm Brian. Hi, Brian. Nice to meet you. I've seen you too. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> it's a weird thing, you this know, when you, you meet people, you yeah, feel like is. they're family. Yes. You watch them so much. Yeah, Logan's been it's on the videos good. all the time. Yep. Yeah. Like, yeah, I can relate to these guys. <laughs> <laughs> I've been doing this since 68. That's, That's impressive. Crazy. That yeah. is impressive. Today's April 21st, 2024. Today we're out of Hammond, Hammond, Indiana, on Lake Michigan here. And you guys saw Jay. Jay's meeting up with us. He's going to be following us. We're heading out here. We're going to set up outside the Hammond Marina and troll north towards Calumet Harbor and uh, see if we can pick up some fish. Last weekend we did real well on coho, couldn't keep them off. Hopefully today stays the same. Uh, we have 50 degree surface temperatures exactly here in the Hammond Arena. Um, it's 6.34 a.m. Central Time. We're gonna be running 12 rods today since we have four people. And we're gonna run, change it up, we're gonna we're gonna experiment a little bit. We're gonna run brads, thin fish, behind boards on the pour side. And then we're gonna run pack rat, thin fish, on the starboard side. So, try to do a little experiment here. We're gonna be using some keel sinkers to get them down. What I actually do is, is use a thin fish, use a six foot fluorocarbon leader, and then the keel sinker, and then hook it up to your main line on your pole. So, um, the, the heavier the kill sinker, the, those go on the inside boards and with shorter leads behind the boards. So, you know, your, your surface oriented baits will be on the outside and farther behind and then your deeper diving or your heavier weighted baits will be on your inside boards. That'll help you with uh, tangles. So we're gonna get set up right outside the marina here and we'll keep you updated. Stay tuned. 
Guys, I wanted to show you this uh, this little fishing log book I got off of Amazon. It's pretty cool. A buddy of mine made it, uh, Hank, and go in here, write down some things. Um, obviously, I have the videos to keep documenting everything, but uh, having a little notepad like that on the boat helps out. You know, especially if you break something or whatever, you can write down what you need to fix or how many fish people have reeled in or whatnot. So check that out on Amazon, guys. It's pretty cool. Okay guys, first fish, 705, got 49 degree surface temps out here. We're just south of the Kaimut Harbor Lighthouse. Pulled up on Coho right now. We got one on the outside board over here, and then we had one on the Dipsy on this side. That's coming in right now. So I think that's on a toxic coat, isn't it? Just says Coho. Cracker. Yeah. Big coho, so watch that really good size coho, guys. Coho cracker, Northeast Coley. Coho cracker. I think this will sink in that front door. Coho cracker, guys. That's the color pattern of the spin. On a dipsy down, what, 40? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Look at that, guys. On that rat pack, yep, rat pack, uh, the orange and yellow stripes with the black dots on it, guys. Back rat. Came off in the net, too. That, was, that fish was on that, uh, that pack rat with the orange and yellow stripes and the black dots, guys. job fellas we're sitting at three it's uh 10 for later. Nice brown guys. Don't back in. Don't back in. Good job. What's this thing called? Shelly snack. Shelly snack? Snag. Shelly snag. Okay. Snack or snag. That's oh, alright. Still coho. Ooh, Logie just Logie just got wrapped. <laughs> oh, no, 50. oh 50. 
Yeah, go ahead, Brian, grab it. That's a nice brown. Look at pretty thing. Awesome, man. Okay. This is a coho cracker, guys. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Awesome. Another one for the box, guys, number four. Okay, Logie's uh, reeling in number six if we can get it in. There you go. Got it! Pack rat! Holy shovel! Hey Max, look at this. Look at that. Deep down in there. Love that pack rat, man. You want to come out? Okay, guys, number six. Yeah, the top board. Yeah, top board. Top board. Again. Top board again. Top board. 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 Nice call. This is number seven. Oh, fish. Yep. Woo! Another fish on that fly, guys. The deep. They always have that deep, guys. They love that fly. Look at that coho. Good job, Max. Number eight, guys. Sorry guys, I'm not paying attention.
dude, I owe you one. Thank you so much. Wasn't even paying attention. Yeah, I owe you big time. Thank you so much. Yeah, yeah, it's tough. It's tough uh, trying to run everything. You're only on four, Logie. What? That's only your fourth. Oh my goodness, guys. It had two, two huge ships coming in, not paying attention. Somebody on the radio told me they were coming in, had two hits. Three hits. Nuts. <laughs> like 44, 45. Nice couple guys. Hey, uh, Bo, this is a little white lung. Uh, that lunch. Just got slammed on the dipsy. Hey, come over this way, Logan. Logan, come back here, bud. There we go. Got him. Got him. Oh, yeah, that's been sweet. Nice leg trial, man. That's a nice one. Yeah. All right, we'll get a quick picture. We'll get a picture of that. Yeah. Nice Laker. Okay, toss him the drink. Red thin fish and he broke that back hook off. Rest of the fish, guys. Let's go. So guys, as we got that lake trout in, he barfed up this big goby. Give you a point of reference. Huge. Lake trout down there just eating them up. Grab fly. Strikes again, boys. All right. hooked up on another big laker, guys. Was that on this year? Bubble cracker, UV from northeast. Oh, it's at 1% to so go for it. Alright, another laker. Nice coho. Nice coho. Nice And that spoon's been hot today. That's a big one, dude. Yeah. What's, what's the color of that spoon? Oh, cracker, like okay. a coho cracker. It's like three dots on it. It's a northeast troll, you guys. Pretty one. What do you think, Logue? It's awesome, guys. Hold on, one thing. Let it come in slow. Let it come in slow. You don't gotta freak out on the neck. Okay. Okay. No pack red flag out of the game, guys. That was the flop. Big one. Bring it up there. Hold on, hold on. Let me get it in first. Yeah, big Laker. Yep. Oh, yeah. Sorry, my bad, man. Yep. Oh, you could probably show your great Laker here too. Take a picture. Uh, oh, right here, right here. 
Logan, stop, bud. Okay, here we go, bud. Ooh, ooh, ooh. One more time, one more time. Go. Oh, he's going to hit. <laughs> oh, he's hot now. Booger. You little booger. Doggone it. If I get up to the surface, I'll be hanging out. Max, that's you. You're more marked than big fish right now. Like big fish. I know, man. Okay. There we go, Logan. Look at the oh, graph. Sorry. Look at the graph when you get a chance. Can I expect your speed down? Another good size coho. I was hitting someone with that net. I'm sorry, whoever I was hitting. You're good, you're good. That's on that, uh, that that's yellow. That's, no, that's a rat. Pack rat. Yeah, pack rat. Here, Max. Max. That's that yellow one. That's pack rat. Dude, this thing might change now. Look at that, guys. Big coho. Pack rat again? Yeah, he does. What do you got along, oh, guys? Is that, he's got, like, he's got Pack rat? Oh, yeah. What do you guys see? Look at that. That was in his mouth. Right? <laughs> Big old bait fish. <laughs> Watch out. The thing you see, he'll step on the road. Still hammered a dipsy. Second one, I'll tell you when I'm ready. Yep, nice Laker. Probably four or five pounds. What's up, Mr. O? Johnny Wirtz? Fun! It's time! Alright, good day today, guys. Those beans, Carter. Yeah. Just landed the nice last nice. piece of the day. Nice. Going to go the home. box, man. Get him off. Another coho, guys. Big coho. Yeah, that's a huge coho. Nice. Good job, Mr. Joe. <laughs> Look at that, guys. Finally. Finally. Smack that dip. There's still three foot swells. Made it back. Man, the wind picked up again. We're back home. We had a little hiccup on the Indiana toll road. So there's potholes out the yin yang. And I run this thing about 65 miles an hour. I normally don't go 70. But we hit a pothole so hard, we busted the spring on the Indiana toll road just west of the portage toll booth and uh fun times so there were we pulled over the wheel well came down the tire started smoking bad i don't know what happened and um got out found out it was a spring there were folks we were by a residential area to the south and there were folks there that um offered to help us they gave us these piece of two by four i had the straps in the truck and uh, we jacked this thing up, got this thing set, and limped it back. Found this little piece of rubber on the on the side of the road as well. So, homeless boat since 2001. First time this has ever happened. So, we got her back. So, thank goodness. But, um, you know, things happen. So, we'll, uh, we'll show you the lures here. So, this thing was red hot. So, it's starting to peel a little bit of this, whatever. Anyways, this is where the wheel well came down and was causing that smoking. So, everybody's okay. Just get a new tire, a new spring. So guys, we're back. And uh, here's the box. But here's the baits. Northeast shoulder. 
the thing it's got it's got uv tape on it um moonshine spoon uh atomic melon this got a nice lake trout shelly snag and uh mixed veggies got a couple coho wonder bread was non-stop you can see all the bite marks on that the king came on the blue dolphin from stingray there's a blue dolphin the king that we missed that the king that we off. missed that came off and, uh the hunter copper king. here are the thin fish guys you know they got brads and then these two are pack rats and this one today uh outperformed the other one from the other day this one caught probably seven or eight fish today and lost about two or three so this one kicked butt so uh guys check them out uh he's selling a bunch of these so uh before he sells out with more of them you might want to get a handful of them before everyone else does because they're selling out pretty quick he's telling us they're flying by so pick them up while you can uh here's the spin doctors we uh i brought out the eight inch spin doctor this is the eight inch uh glow double glow pearl with a pickled sunshine fly on uh dream weaver's website and then we got the baby spin doctor with a uh, green wrinkle glow from pack rat lures awesome fly guys this took probably seven eight fish so nice what, solid coho guys so what apparatus is where everything here like boards uh riggers and coppers guys we're all spoons uh top boards were thin fish and with kill sinkers we had this one this uh pack rat and the spin doctor that pack rat fly those were our two kill sinkers guys baits and this was on a dipsy we had uh you know spoons dipsies with spoons and the uh, coppers spoons and here are the here are the coho guys big ones they're pushing four pounds now as a matter of fact we thought this might be undersized and it turned out to be 17 so as reference guys these are nice coho really nice i bet you that dude's three and a half four pounds So guys, uh, Calumet Harbor, we fish pretty much the Calumet Harbor area, also the east side of the East Chicago break wall, but primarily most of the day was spent in Calumet Harbor, and we didn't hardly mark any bait pods at all. So I doubt if we, we go out of Hammond that much more going forward. But it seems to be the bite is happening in Portage and also the south side of East Chicago break wall. And I've had a fun time. Jay came over, he had a fun time. He ended up boxing uh, nine and I think he had like um you know 19 on or something like that so he had a tough time hooking up but he had a good time first time heading over the southwest corner of lake michigan so you guys have a good time brian had a good time last year uh we had a tough day but um had a good day today right brian yes we had a great day awesome day guys max we kicked butt what is it 3.7 that's, that's what i thought after being after blood, being blood. So it was probably like four so All right, guys, so stay tuned for the next video. Thanks for coming along.